I'm Miss Pam and we're doing art today. We're making round critters. So we're drawing, but it's fun drawing. So what you're going to need is you're going to need a piece of paper, a pencil, and the paper should be about this size, just an 8x10 plain piece of white paper. A pencil, one with an eraser because I always use up erasers. And then you're going to need some things to make circles. So I have a lavender, I have a lotion, I have a jar, and I have some honey. And we need these for the covers so that we can make round circles. Okay? Ready to draw the tiger? Here we go. Again, we're going to make a circle. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to put ears on this tiger. Alright, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to make a mark on his forehead like this. Okay, how about some eyes on this tiger? See how easy this is? Now we're going to fill in the ears of that tiger. Okay, how about a nose? the nose you're going to go down and make him smile it's also so that he can eat okay and the last thing we're gonna oh we got to put some stripes on him right one there we go let's put some right over there right over there right over there oh is he missing something whiskers let's try some whiskers There we go. We have a tiger. We're doing a chicken. Here we go. Again, you have your circle. I do not. So let me make a circle. First thing we're going to do is put the thing on his head. And let's do that. Let me back it down a bit more like that. There. Sort of looks like a crown, but it's a chicken. Let's put some feet on him first. Okay. All right. Let's make some little tiny eyes. There. All right. So we need some feathers coming down. And we need a nose. I don't think they call it a nose, but I call it a nose. And there, we have a chicken. Bee time! Let's get started! So, again, we're going to make a circle like we do every time. That's not very round, but I'll try to make it round. And we're going to make the wings, and we're just going to make a doodad look that. And we'll do the other side, and just do that. So, the next thing we do on the B is we are making the B lines. I'm going to draw in some dark lines. We'll make another one here. And a third one here. Now we're starting to look like a bee, not a butterfly. All right. What else does a bee need? <gasps> Antenna. So, whoop, whoop. Something's wrong. We need something else. And we ought to have a mouth, and we ought to have a little line there. <gasps> and there he is. A bee. Next we'll draw a ladybug. So, again we need a circle. A 
First thing we'll do is put eyes on. What else does a ladybug have? Legs. So we'll draw two up here and two down here. There. Are we done? Oh, I forgot. Let's put some spots. So between the eyes, you're going to make a line coming so it's a big triangle. And then get up at the point and come down and make a triangle. Okay? Next, we're going to make the spots. Thank you. We'll have another video next week. Bye.